I'm gonna try to frame perfect running out and getting into another. <laughs> wrong thing, wrong thing. Nope, so it doesn't work at all. It doesn't have to do with like a certain number of steps I have, it has to do with... Yeah, you're not so sleep though. Uh, let's start looking at things. Stop it, David. Do what I tell you. Documents are strewn on the desk. Maybe I can give him some paper cuts. Maybe I can knock a shelf down on him, but I doubt it. I can hide in one of those boxes and be like, Ugh, solid snake. I don't know. I really have no idea what I'm expected to do here. What items do I have? Am I supposed to use the crowbar on him? I have to keep doing this and talking to random stuff. Maybe I'm supposed to just live a certain amount of time. May I try to talk to a cardboard box? Nope. Talk to the bookshelf? Nope. Lots of books. Maybe I'm just supposed to... Times are changing. I'll read to him. That's it. I'll read to him. Times are changing. Our existing laws are of no use anymore. We must surpass the father of our law to find the true answer. Did that work? Can I, like, throw my crowbar at him? Ha! Ha! Those are David's fighting sounds. Screw it, I look to the eye. Uh, I can't even hear myself talking. It got really loud. I wonder if you were able to hear me. I hope so. So, yeah, I get, I get the feeling that, uh... Yeah. Alright, let's uh, figure out something. Documents are strewn on the desk. I don't know why I'm just running around, but I don't know what else I'm gonna do. Maybe he's supposed to catch me in here. I feel like I'm fighting Jaws. Because of the music. I need to get close to the microphone to make sure you can hear me. Push the chair into him! Push the chair into him! Hide in the box! Honestly, like, what am I doing? Somebody? Any ideas? What do they want me to do? Knock the shelf on him. That didn't work. What do I do? I know it's probably really obvious and you guys are like yelling at me and... Why did I do that? Now I have to exit the game and start it back up. Come on. I'll be back, Yons. I'm in the game, start it back up, and get it started recording again and load the game. And I guess I won't record my next attempts because I'm sure that you're already tired of this, so I will see you as soon as I've figured it out. Have a wonderful day, Yons, and don't forget, this game contains sudden surprises and harsh images. Hello, all of my Yons. So, I have kind of sad news for you. Uh, I spent like 20 minutes doing different things trying to figure out what the heck to do to solve this and then gave up and ended up looking it up. I hate having to look stuff up. I don't like it. But I want to be able to get lots of these episodes out for you. And I hate like having breaks in between just because of like getting stuck on things in game and stuff. So I looked it up and I found out what you're supposed to do is get out of get out of the room, and then you lock the door on him, if I'm correct. Because- oh, get that mouse out of there. Because apparently I have the door key to this room, and I can use it to lock the door and keep him inside. Oh my god! Go, 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 go! How do I- how do I lock it? How do I lock it? Use the key? There it is, John- John Smith- there we go. Uh, locked the room. <sighs> How is a person supposed to figure that out? Surely that'll keep it in. Whew. I don't understand. But this is so bizarre. I mean, back at the hotel. And the hotel's hours away, isn't it? Could it really be following me? Why? How? Damn it, this is making me nuts! Or am I already going crazy? Am I just hallucinating this thing? Then again, it did attack Sissy, so it can't be my imagination. It exists. Monster that it is. D. If that monster is here, I have to warn D. Tell him he's going. He's got to get out of here. Dear God. I really hope it doesn't have more like puzzle things like that. That 
I would say are seemingly impossible to figure out. But, I mean, I'm sure people would have figured that out. I don't know. Alright, so what am I doing now? Going to the first floor so I can use the lecture hall thing. Let's save. Did I save? I don't know, but... Saving anyway. Use the lecture hall key. Interesting. D. Where is this applause coming from? Do you carry around a sound recorder and just randomly play applause for yourself so that you'll feel better? I thought I was the only one who did that. Friends, faculty, and s Wait, is it D talking? Oh, friends, faculty, staff, I thank you for coming today. Today is, for us, the best day of our lives. I don't know, because today... We leave the nest of our school and begin our climb to adulthood. Those who passed the bar exam, those who didn't, those becoming clerks or notaries or teachers, all of us will be graduating from this school, and we owe a great debt to it. Even though, or though even if they manage to graduate, some of us may need to put a little more time into their studies. <laughs> ah, 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 ah. But these graduates have one thing in common. They're filled with hope for their future. They're ready to challenge what lies ahead. A toast to our dreams, to our yet unsure futures, and may we have God's grace. Yay! Yay! What was that? D. How did you get into this lecture room? Wasn't the hallway locked? Eh? You forget I'm a graduate here? I know all the secret ways, dummy. Huh. Well... What were you listening to? A tape? Yeah, I didn't think it was him talking, that's why I changed the voice. Yeah, for my graduation day. Man, has it really been three years? I was getting nostalgic for the place. And even abandoned, it really hasn't changed. It's just like it was when I was taking classes. Studying was wearing me out, so I came here for a breather. It's nice to have places full of memories like this. Huh? You graduated, but you're still studying? Hey, lay off! Yeah, I couldn't pass the bar exam, so I'm cramming at home now. Next up's gonna be my sixth attempt. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't do that voice while looking at his face and keep a straight face. There were lots of great guys in my class, most of them passed in one shot. Being a lawyer has been my dream since I was a kid. So I was happy when I got accepted here. Felt I was one step closer to making it come true. Tell me if this voice is bothering you. I'm enjoying using it, but it doesn't fit him. I mean, sort of does with the way he was talking, but I don't know. The work was rough, and I just barely managed to graduate. I think it's my kind, helpful professors that did it. I'll pass next time for sure. I mean, it's my sixth time. Anymore, and I'll be way behind my classmates. You're not already way behind? Never mind. Well, it's good to be motivated, but it's dangerous here. You should get out of here soon. Huh? Dangerous? What? It's sort of hard to explain. There's kind of a monster here. It'll attack you if it finds you. I thought you were just some weird old guy wandering in an abandoned school, but damn, you really are nuts, huh? Seriously, a monster? Even little girls don't believe that stuff. You're being a total doofus. Do you enjoy making fun of people? And I don't think I'm much older than- Ahem! God, that was weird. <laughs> don't quarrel with me, alright? I'm a talented soon-to-be lawyer. You'd be no match for me. Ah, oh, what do you want? Uh, ah, uh, do what you want. But don't say I didn't warn you. Yeah, I will do what I want. Like, thanks. Like I need some shady punk like you telling me what to do around my alma mater. Please tell me if you want me to change the voice. I hope that's not, like, ruining it for you or anything. Hey. Paul, I... I got in. W what Really? You got in... to flight school? Oh god. 
That's crazy. David, I can't even do a handstand. Sorry, I just felt it was necessary for an awkward silence. When do you do handstands when you're flying planes? You can do whatever you put your mind to. <laughs> uh, thanks. But it doesn't make me a pilot yet. Yeah, still have to pass the exam. Man, dude, you totally will be. Make sure to give me a ride. I'd love to. I'd love to fly above a city sometime. Paul, I'm not going to fly passenger planes. It's not that kind of school. Don't sweat the details. I'm glad for you. You did good. Hey, I'll take you to lunch today. Shh, shh, shh. Calm down, phone. It's okay. Back then, I wasn't really thinking. I was just doing what, going wherever I wanted. I wonder if D is like that. Living a life that you might enjoy. Lined with reference books. Lined with reference books. Saving game right now. Saving game right now. Looking at the chalk. Looking at the board. Talking to the clock. Checking out the star. 